a look at the books on pandemics that shook the world. With most of the people around the world going on self-isolation due to the coronavirus attack, reading books is a welcome change for sure. Ever since Corona or COVID-19 took the shape of a pandemic, people are staying at home in quarantine. People now have enough time in hand to read some bestsellers in fiction and non-fiction genres and to spend time meaningfully. Oh, are you looking for some books? Books? If you're looking for some books, let us list out the books on pandemics that have happened in the past. Number one, The Hot Zone by Richard Preston. As the subtitle reads, the terrifying true story of the origins of the Ebola virus, it became a number one best-selling book for a reason. The book is not for the faint-hearted. As a sci-fi genre book, it goes on intricate details that haunted the African continent for years. As a medical journal, this book is one of the highest rated pandemic themed books. Number two, The American Plague by Molly Caldwell Crosby. The book is about a journalist who takes us through the years when the USA was under the attack of yellow fever. The epidemic took the lives of around 20,000 people in and around Memphis. The book journals the research by three scientists who visit Cuba in the 1900s to learn more about yellow fever and to get to its origins. The use of heart-wrenching metaphors and imageries brings out the impact on us even today. Number three, The Andromeda Strain by Michael Crichton. Highly appreciated by Stephen King, this horrifying sci-fi book is written by the best-selling author Michael Crichton. The writer depicts the effects of a mysterious and what appears to be an extraterrestrial microorganism that reaches Piedmont, Arizona. How a group of scientists does everything in their power to contain the virus from spreading and take the shape of a big outbreak. Number 4. The Flu by Gina Colata. The year was 1918 when the influenza flu took the form of a pandemic. The great influenza flu was mercilessly killing people across the USA and villages and settlements were wiped out by this. The book gives chilling details of the flu and the virus that led to the causing of this pandemic. Number 5. Spillover, Animal Infections and the Next Human Pandemic by David Quarman. When the experts started discussing on a virus that was coming to humans from wildlife and termed it spillover, David Quarman undertook a journey to chronicle the same. The writer takes us to Central Africa and finally to secretive labs where the researchers did strategic studies on viruses. Has he been talking about the coronavirus so far? Read it to know more about the deadly virus that has gone out of control. Number 6, Inferno by Dan Brown. When a symbologist and Harvard professor, Robert Langdon, finds himself with a secret of a potential threat lurking around the world, he must rush up. The gripping tale is about how a criminal mastermind has used Dante's Inferno to hide the clues and codes and finally create the apocalypse in the world. The reasoning for the same will shock you. Will Langdon be able to save the world from the end? The fiction is one of the most popular titles by Dan Brown. The mysterious criminal says his intention is genuine and is the most benevolent ever. Is he the Dr. Evil of the medieval era or just a maniac in a bid to ruin the world? Number 7. Pandemic. The Extinction Files Book 1 by A.G. Riddle. When an American Coast Guard vessel discovers a sunken submarine without any records, it begins a search operation. This leads them to discover deep secrets, making no sense. On the other side, with an Ebola-like epidemic on the rise, it is up to Dr. Peyton Shaw to assemble her team and work towards tracing the origin of the pathogen. Is there a big conspiracy around the corner, or is it a natural outbreak taking the form of a pandemic? Only time will tell. Number 8. Zone 1. A novel by Colson Whitehead. As you wonder about what other books can be a gripping read, go for the Zone 1 novel. It is set in a post-apocalyptic Manhattan south of Canal Street, which is now the Zone 1. Mark Spitz is one of the cleaners with the task of reclaiming Manhattan after removing the feral zombies from roaming around. Suffering from a sleep disorder, he has to fight out his mental dreams and the ones lurking around him in the world that is already over. Number 9. The Companion by Katie M. Flynn. 
California is struck by a deadly virus and is under quarantine. The dead in the city have become shapeshifters and can come into your home in any form, animate or inanimate. Metis Corporation is the corporate giant making the spirits of people as companions. The rich who have signed up for the companionship plan can stay in the care of their own families while the poor rent out to their strangers. Number 10, Station 11 by Emily St. John Mandel. We have reserved the special one until the last one. One of the best pandemic books that won rave reviews has been the dark novel. The book is a discourse through the years, beginning with the attack of a pandemic and the way it devastates an entire generation and civilizations that follow it. The book is about a Hollywood star, Arthur Leander, who had a heart attack on stage while enacting King Lear. That was also the night the pandemic Georgia flu struck the city and slowly the entire civilization got under its influence. Many years later, a group of travelling theatre artists talk of this post-apocalyptic world and Mandel uses the wordplay to create a chilling read. Books are undoubtedly enlightening and engaging and make you realise the ways the world has jumped back to its feet after every pandemic. Coronavirus is not the first of its kind and it will take some time before a vaccine for the same comes up. However, that is not the reason for you to make your quarantine time at home boring. So I hope this list of books keeps you from getting bored and also makes you realise that things have come and gone in the past and we will overcome. Stay safe. Avila Publishing.